but the centre of attention, as at Monza, is a confrontation between the Porsches and the very, very quick Lancia Martini turbo cars with their 600 horsepower Ferrari-built V8 engines and their all-Italian team of star Grand Prix drivers. The duel between Porsche and Lancia at Monza had been all too brief. Late in the second qualifying session, the crowd is treated to a sensational performance from the Rothman team's new young star, Stefan Beloff driving a Porsche for the very first time in anger, but on a track on which he's excelled in Formula 2, pulls out of the hat an absolutely magical time of 1 minute 13.15 seconds. It is not just that Beloff's time represents an average speed of over 144 miles an hour, it is also two whole seconds faster than the best efforts of his teammate Derek Bell and the reigning world endurance champion Jackie Ix. The 22-year-old German could hardly have marked his arrival on the endurance racing scene better than this. He is obviously superbly talented and has delighted his new partner at Rothmans Porsche, Derek Bell. Talent and experience. It looks like the team has come up with a winning combination. We have installed a camera in Porsche number two alongside Stefan Beloff on one of his qualifying laps. Just ahead of us now is the Rothmans Porsche car number one driven by Jackie X. We go through the Woodford chicane before we start our flying qualifying lap around the 2.93 mile Silverstone Grand Prix circuit. Across the finishing line we go. We head up towards Cox Corner which is taken in third gear at about 100 miles an hour. Up to fourth gear. We snatch fifth gear at Maggots, which is flat out at 160 miles an hour. Down through the gears, we brake hard for Beckett's, which is taken in third gear at 90 miles an hour. We come hard out of Beckett's and snatch fourth gear at Chapel Curve. Flat through there at 130 miles an hour into fifth gear for Hangar Straight. Here we hit 175 miles an hour before we break for Stowe, which is taken in fourth gear at 130 miles an hour. We just manage to hold on to fourth gear until we come up to club corner, taken in fourth at 130 miles an hour. You can hear the screech of the tyres. Out of club corner, up to fifth gear, flat out through Abbey Curve. We now reach 160 miles an hour. We go under the bridge, which is the fastest part of the track. We reach 180 miles an hour, break hard for Woodcutcher chicane, which is taken in third gear at 90 miles an hour. Flick out the tail as we cross the finishing line. And that was a lap of the Grand Prix circuit here at Silverstone. Interestingly enough, the time that Stefan Beroff had just done, 1 minute 17.85 seconds, would have put him on the fourth row of the grid for the British Grand Prix when the ground effects Formula One Grand Prix cars were in existence here for the British Grand Prix. So a superb performance by the young West German driver, Stefan Beloff. Revisions to engine electronics since Monza have improved the fuel consumption.